All right, so let's start with the big story that we are tracking on Beyond this arm, where it's been three weeks since the Taliban has taken charge of Afghanistan. And the world, of course, is watching Taliban's attempts to form a new government in Afghanistan. The Taliban, remember, were expected to announce the government in Kabul on Friday afternoon, but the announcement has been delayed to the coming week. And the delay coincides with the arrival of the senior Pakistani military officials delegation in Kabul led by Pakistan's top spy agency chief, Faiz Hamid, who reportedly has also met with Taliban's senior leader and co-founder, Mullah Abdul Ghani Brother in Kabul, ahead of any decisions on a new government. Hamid, the head of Pakistan's inter-services intelligence, is the highest-ranking foreign official to have visited Afghanistan since the Taliban's takeover. The ISI and the Pakistani military have been long accused of being very supportive and also of strengthening the Taliban and other anti-state forces in Afghanistan. Hamid is visiting Afghanistan at the invitation of the Taliban to discuss the future of the two nations. It said that Pakistan's ambassador to Afghanistan will be holding talks with the Taliban while he's only working for peace and stability in the country. But the visit, of course, is being seen very closely as an attempt by Pakistan to strengthen Islamabad's leverage within the region. Just landed and uh, we are working for peace and stability peace. in Afghanistan. Don't worry, everything will be okay. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. According to what we all has gathered from sources, the key discussion in the meetings included the pending requests from countries and international organizations for repatriation through Pakistan and how a mechanism could in fact be determined, allowing for evacuations through Pakistan. Migrant crisis as well as border management are also subjects in question, especially for Afghans who routinely cross over and then return between the very porous borders between Afghanistan and Pakistan. The overall security issue is also registered to ensure that spoilers and terror organizations do not take advantage of the very fluid situation. A visit by a Pakistani delegation also followed the British Foreign Secretary Dominic Raab's visit to Islamabad, where the Pakistan's Chief of Army Staff, General Khamar Javad Bajwa, told Dominic Raab that Islamabad will assist the Taliban in the formation of an inclusive administration in Afghanistan. The Mullah Abdul Ghani brother also held talks with Qatar's special envoy for counterterrorism and mediation of conflict resolution, Mutlaq bin Majid al Kahtani. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.